Sorry, Tom. Now this partnership is not just, is, is built not just on, on respect but on trust. And our militaries will continue working together to increase interoperability and to support regional security and stability. I especially wanted to be here today to share that Qatar and the United States will formally take steps forward to expand and reinforce our bilateral defense relationship. We'll do this through Qatar's commitment to contribute significant resources uh, to increase capabilities here at Al Hadi Air Base. And that will support both of our forces for years to come. Qatar has been an indispensable partner. In times of crisis, Qatar answers our call. Together with Egypt, Qatar's efforts have helped to secure the release of many hostages held by Hamas. And earlier this year, Qatar was also key to our efforts to release five American citizens from imprison imprisonment in Iraq. And we won't forget that in 2021, Qatar helped the U.S. military complete one of the largest airlifts in history, evacuating more than 124,000 people from Afghanistan to safety. So these are just a few reasons why the department welcomes this step forward. It's a milestone for our defense partnership, and we look forward to doing more together and to make this region more stable and more secure. So thank you again. <laughs>